Oh, hey, Alarm Clockman, I've just received intel that Sinister Titan Clockman is somewhere nearby. Oh, my God! This is terrible news. What should we do in this situation, boss? First of all, no panic. Like you, I can turn back time. But that's not enough. I want to gather everyone and come up with a plan. Relax. I'm not an enemy. Why the alarm? Sorry, I got a little jumpy after hearing the news. If it helps, boss, I still have a knife. What news exactly? Sinister Titan Clockman might be lurking around, and I want to know what each of us can bring to the table. I can tell you everything about plants. I'm reading a fascinating book on them right now, but I can also heal you, or rather, rewind time to when you weren't damaged. Hello there. I've heard some really alarming rumors. Yeah, we're already aware. Now tell us, how exactly can you help with this? Hmm. I can stop time entirely. Wow! That's amazing. For how long? Just one hour, no more. I think you need to get stronger. There's a scientist working on something for you as we speak. In that case, I'll be back soon. You won't even notice I'm gone. A few moments later. And I'm back. You were literally gone for a second. Told you, you wouldn't notice. So, here's the deal. I've got some upgrades. First, I got a jetpack. Second, I have a new weapon. Now, I can use my bullets to either slow down or speed up enemies. Not bad, but it still feels like we'll need more than that. Good evening, I've come to help you. And who are you exactly? How do I put this? I'm you, but from another universe. You've heard of the multiverse theory, right? Well, it's not just a theory, it's a fact. I'm Isa. What? This doesn't make any sense. I have abilities almost identical to yours, except I can levitate. Plus, I've got a few allies. I received your message on my portable radio and came as soon as I could, Aza. Awesome. Glad to see your multiverse messaging works. Everyone, meet Ethan from Universe 99 and Mr. Clock. He's like a chameleon and can take on the form of any agent. Sorry to interrupt, but I have urgent news. Sinister was spotted in Sector 79. No one from that area has reported back. Damn it. We need to act fast. Should we scout the area first? That's an excellent idea. I think this is the perfect job for us. Boss, let me accompany them. I think my hammer might come in handy if things get rough. Oh god, I really hope it doesn't come to that. What else can you contribute? With my hammer, I can charge any ally with energy, and that might just save lives. Fantastic! All right, everyone stay still. I'm teleporting us all now. Hello? Hello? Uh, where is everyone? I heard we're having a group meeting. We are, but some have already gone on a scouting mission. It seems there's good reason to believe Sinister is back, and we need to act. That's terrible news. No worries, though. My time revolver is ready to fire a few rounds and freeze anyone I hit. I want one of those, too. Oh, and if needed, I can heal you. I'm like Torsion Pendulum Clockman, but much more effective. Well, well, well. Did you really call me Chief Clockman? I thought you hated me. It's not quite like that. I don't like your methods, but that doesn't matter now. We have serious problems. What can you do to help? I can throw a spear and recall it. I can also decapitate with my spine claws, but I won't demonstrate that. I've heard the stories. I'm here too. Together we can form a protective sphere. Watch this. And what does it do? It reflects projectiles. So yeah, we're super useful. You can't just ignore us. Good evening. I finished my latest development and I need a few volunteers for testing. Thank you, Scientist Clockman. I think Elite Clockman and Elite Clockwoman should go with you to test everything out. <laughs> Let's go. I'm very curious to see this in action. Good evening. I've arrived to deliver my report. Allow me to introduce the latest mechanism for close and ranged combat. I can fire from a dual web cannon. 
And trust me, it's nearly impossible to escape from these webs. Additionally, I can embed my claws into the ground and skewer enemies with earth and spikes. Oh, and of course, I can perform the usual time manipulations. Well, hello to you too. I think I even know who's inside. Come on out, let's talk. And here I am. Behold, future large clockman. Isn't that a bit too grandiose for just one person? Wait, you're me from the future, aren't you? No, it's a little more complicated than that. Trust me, you don't want to know the kind of time loop I got stuck in. But it does come with perks. I can stop time better than any of you. I can heal, just like you, ma'am. I can activate a defensive shield, and I can even take control of enemies or allies. It's probably easier to list what you can't do. You might be right. I also have hyperspeed and the ability to create multiverse portals. Impressive. I know where I'm most needed, so I'll take my leave now. Oh my god, that's a titan and it's dead. Damn it all. Sinister got to it before we did. Stay calm. I know what to do. Many thanks. What was that? Oh, I've heard about them. Those are the Time Striders. Like you, they can heal by rewinding time, but their powers are incredible. As you can see, they can even revive titans. Spot on. Now, I'm ready to fight. I've got a weapon that stops time, blades to shred enemies, and my primary weapon is a sword, along with a holographic shield. I can manipulate time in any way imaginable, even create illusions within time. I can peer into the future and take control of enemies. You're simply the best among us. Wow, so big. So you thought you could all gather, talk things through, and somehow stop me? Smirks, let me introduce you to what you're truly up against. I've got a blade that can cut through time itself. I'll gut you with my arrows. If you think you can run, my gravity grenades will hunt you down. And if I feel like it, I'll freeze time across the entire universe. 